Hey, we're back again with another video. I'm consistent. Look at me. I'm making videos consistently. Somewhat good content. And my room's clean. I'm not sure if you watched that video. You should watch that video. I'll put that somewhere in the description to watch it. Me cleaning my room, which was took forever, but it's great. So yeah, all presentable. I'm just so proud of myself. And I thought, well, since I look so good and I'm doing everything that I should be and I'm being protect uh can't speak productive, I thought you should film a video. But then I said, What video? Like what am I gonna do that I haven't done that doesn't look boring, that isn't terrible because so I said, Well, last video I was doing of the Instagram picks my makeup was supposed to be basically a review of the Soul Culture palette by Anastasia Bucky Hills, but everything really messed up as you know, so I didn't really get to really do it all as the way I wanted to. So I said, we're gonna do it again. We're gonna not do Instagram this time because I'm sick of Instagram. They don't support me. Plus I don't I don't ever know how to work it, so <laughs> Yeah, so I'm using the Anastasia, which I like do how the baby goes, oh my god, almost fell into my noodles. I'm using the Anastasia Cell Culture palette today for this video. I hope it works well. It didn't really work, I'm not saying it didn't work well last video, but it did. I just wasn't like, I wasn't expecting it to be so dark as it was before, but I think I know how to work it a little bit better now, so so yeah, just carry on with the video, watch along, and um, so of course I'm going to start off with my eyebrows, I was called long wear, 24 hour, super brow, um, shade black, I want to see, it's really pretty, I like the casing of it, I think it's cute, um, it's super dark. <laughs> Oh, it's the shade Graphite, if you're also noticing, if you wondered what shade it was. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna do my brows, and you guys can just watch along. I feel a little bit on the brush when I'm dipping it in, so... Should I be closer, or should I bring you guys closer? I don't know how to zoom in. I'm not that talented. No. Only thing I will say about this product that I really worry about sometimes is that it comes off too dark which is why I'll that's why I have both the NYX brown dip brow and I have this shade so if I really wanted to go for something like more natural I would just use that and if I wanted something more out there and different this is what be something I would choose but this one's really dark but then <laughs> I don't really like to oh, say, so I can't really like zoom in much on this, um, but I only do, I start from the tail, I fill that in, and then I leave this whole front part, like I don't touch it, because I don't want it to be super dark or look some type of way. Look, I just go under a little bit, and after that, I don't touch the rest of it. I kind of messed up <laughs> this brow, but it's okay, I'm gonna fix it. Now I'm going in for concealer. I'm using NYX um, HD Studio Photogenic Concealer. I don't know what shade this is. Shade CW07. Can you see that? <laughs> um. I like this. Bought it recently. I think some days it looks really, really like um white, but I don't know. It could be me. 
this concealer. And also, like I know that American Horror Story just released the first episode of um, Apocalypse. I don't know if anyone watches American Horror Story, but I watch it and I haven't like, well I haven't watched the new season, but I've heard mixed feelings about it and it kind of gets me worried because like, they're, I know they're adding like three seasons into one. And my favorite season is like Coven that they're adding in there. And I really like, I know that they're gonna have people play double characters. I just feel like they shouldn't have done it. Like, I think they should just have brought um, the characters from that soul season, cut them as that character, and not um, play like the double parts because I don't know. Now I'm going to blend out my concealer under my eyebrows. Why does the eyebrow look weird? I just keep looking at it and something doesn't look right. Oh well, let's put the eyebrows with the palette. Um, and then I usually just brush it out in the front, like blend it out. Same thing for the upper brow. stayed up all night all night because one I had really bad cramps so I couldn't go to sleep and then two I started like watching a bunch of like um you know like the YouTube channel shook started watching their videos and I just like couldn't stop watching okay so I had to like move <laughs> the camera because Lines. It's like it releases me outside, so I had to move the camera over because I didn't want. See, see them right now. I didn't want the blinds like that. So right now I'm just gonna conceal my eyes so that they're ready. Um, here. I'm taking this color right here, this brown. And I'm just gonna put it right onto my crease. So once you're done doing that, I'm just gonna add. I'm just gonna since I am using this so culture palette, <laughs> trying my best not to use anything else. Um, I'm gonna take the shade All Star. Ooh, might as well use this brush in here. It's so big though. I'm using the shade All Star right here. I'm not sure if you can see All Star. And I'm gonna put it right on the inner outer corner of my eye. I'm not gonna cover the whole thing. I'm just gonna take a little bit. I'm just gonna dash that. I'm not covering my full eye. I'm going in a little bit. On the, I don't even know what the call is, but like on the outer V of your eye. Just blend it all in with the color that you have put in the crease so that you don't have any harsh lines or nothing crazy going on. So I'm just gonna go with a nice, like, orangey brown and put that over where we have put our crease just to blend that in. I would show you the color that I'm using, but honestly, like, any light color than the brown that you were using before, which is like a, one I was using was like a little chocolate one, go over it just to blend it out so it's not like really dark. Okay, so after you had blended all of that, I'm um, gonna add black. I'm using this black from my first night one palette because it's very dark and I don't need it for this. So just use any black. And 
take some of that. And you're gonna put it where you had put the previous color on your V line, just shading it over. Um, now here's the fun part, but also slash scary part because it can always go good or bad. You're going to cut your crease out. Thus, we're gonna cut it out. So I always get weird and I do stuff like. Like, if you do it good or bad, you can, like, ruin the look. So, it's gonna go out from your crease and just put it over. I feel like I should have used my one product for this, but too late. Too late. I'm not sure you can see what we're working with right now. Don't worry, I'm gonna make it good. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna get this. I'm using the color Dawn in this palette. I'm taking Dawn and I'm gonna put it over my eyelid. We'll go with. I'm trying to think. Okay, we're gonna take. All Star first because I've had an idea, but I'm just gonna wait and see if this works. So I'm gonna take All Star again, the shade, and put it back on your V line over the um, a little bit over the black that we had already put on here. I'm gonna take the shade Roxy, this pretty color right here. Oxy, and we're gonna put that, we're gonna blend that over the two Dawn and All Star. Okay, so right now it looks crazy. I'm just gonna go back in with this shade that we used before. Because right now, I don't know. Think about it like people do stuff like this every day, and they're most likely talking to themselves. And like, I didn't even have like an imaginary friend to talk to, so like, how could I talk to a camera like I'm doing now? Like, it just makes me feel like I need help. Like, I feel like I'm insane. Like, I'm not insane, but I kind of am. You know what I mean? See, I'm talking to you now. I feel like this is wrong. I'm just gonna take some gold from here. I think I might use electric um, or adorn, but I think I'm also gonna use electric to just take that out and shade it all in. I feel like they're actually kind of the same shade. Doesn't it the same electric and this? I don't know, call me crazy, but they look the same. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna take that and put it all on my inner corner. And this stuff is like really glittery too, it's really pretty. So yeah, I just took Adorn and I took, um, I feel like this actually has a shade, like a name name. I can know it's Dabble Shadow, but it's I like to watch. <laughs> I don't know, but it's, it's cute, it's a cute colors so I use it a lot so yeah I'm about to clean this off with concealer once I put my foundation on yes so hey I'm back I'm currently putting some color corrector on my eyes because I have bags you know and like I like to hide my imperfections with makeup, um, as everybody else does. So yeah, it's really the only thing that I color correct. Like I have a whole bunch of like color correct stuff, but I mostly just use it for my bags because it's messy.
I'm taking my Yorino Water Back Studio Fix Foundation. I really don't like wearing foundation that much. The only time I really wear it is for like a dance and for like these videos, of course. Every time like I do foundation though, I think of the scene from um, Edward Richard Hands with like the lady, she's like, one. That's the key. If you don't know what I'm talking about, I'll just put it up the program. Then you blend and blend and blend. Blending is the secret. Mm-hmm. And then the conceal don't fail underneath my eyes. We love a, a line. This is like, um, oh yeah, I mentioned this. I was going to show you how I like just fix the line without tape. I did just concealing. Um, literally, that's all you do is just put concealer in the field. Um, also, another trick is if you want like a really sharp, like, ooh, I have a hair there. Um, eyeliner line, I think I'll have a deadly, like, knife. Um, look, concealer. That's all I can say. I mean, if you want to use tape, sure, but like, I just feel like concealer makes it. Mmm. Do the tape for tape and the tape for things that are nasty. Like, I have glitter on my face now because of this. I'm gonna take some more concealer and put it alongside my neck and blend, blend, blend. Using what is this L'Oreal Superstar Eyeliner? Out my nose. He's already put concealer on me. Good, like, for approval. Like, no. And just contour out this area. I don't know why I said this area. It's called. With the. Um, I'm using the Too Faced Peach. Now, last time I used this, I didn't know how to use it. And I'm using it again for like the second time, and I still don't know how to use it, but that's okay. I think you just shake it through. That's my made a mess. I had put it all over my desk and I didn't make it out, so. I hope this works, because I really don't know. Let's just take this off. Yes, yes. Well, I see really nothing on it. There's nothing on it. Nothing. But it smells so good. I hope that this works. Nope. Okay. Well, whatever. We're good. Just gonna take my brush. I'm just gonna wait for a bit for it to do its thing. I need to go buy a new one, though it only costs like two dollars. At when did this come out? Why did I not notice it? Stop everything. How? 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 I thought, I'm not cute. 
This is definitely never gonna come out. Never came out. Uh, this is taking a bit too long. Yay! Okay, so I'm using two. <laughs> I'm mixing these. It's really crazy. This is Elf, and I got this at Elf. Don't mind my nails. We're just going like this, so you can't see my nails. This is Elf. I purchased that at Forever 21, and it was like two dollars. It's really cheap. Like their makeup is really cheap. Anywho, it was like kind of drying up. And I like the like product in this Clinique one, so we're just gonna do a switcher since I don't wear ball suits. As I still, I'm still seeing my face. I want this to look good, so we're still gonna study. Of a bottom lip. Now do both lips for you. So just a little bit on the bottom of this. It actually looks kind of cute if I wasn't wearing this ugly shirt. But okay, so we've set this long enough. Long enough. I need like a thumbnail picture. One of these would be those. But anyway, oh my god, I almost took one of these colors and put it in my face. I'm gonna blend out the setting powder. Okay, so for blush, she's broken. My blush is broken, but I use this a lot. This is Estee Lauder. I don't know what shade. Maybe I do. It's the 23 shade plum Estee Lauder blush. I don't know if these. It's a bronzer powder set, and I'm using this bronzer color to finish this. Okay, I can't read. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna go on and highlight that. This. Here's what we're working with. Overall, though I made this look really white because I had left it in really long. I think it looks cute. The eyes look cute. 
it's cute and I like it and you should try it out or whatever if you want to. Anyway, love to say that I'm trying to make more videos. Um, probably won't post every day. Like this is probably gonna be posted how I uploaded yesterday, but like that's not gonna happen. So don't get used to me uploading every day because I don't have time for that. So yeah, I make videos when I want to. You should probably not gonna force you to but I'm saying probably probably do you get them anyway you should like like this video and subscribe to it and go watch my other stuff if you're bored or if you like this I feel like I have runny nose now oh yeah Dan bye Hey, 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 I'm a zebra. What, what, I'm a zebra. What, what, I'm a zebra.